Welcome back. As we were telling you earlier, Erie County lawmakers are looking into a new dental plan that may change the information that your dentist shares with you. Now, this is a win-win for Western New York because we have a number of local laboratories who specialize in making dentures, crowns, and more. Experts we spoke with say this new law could pave the way for a business boom that will have many smiling from ear to ear. Here's 7 Eyewitness News reporter Justin Moore with the story. The whole thing should be set on what is best for the patient. Open wide. Do you know what your dentist is putting in your mouth when you go for a procedure? These dental professionals are pushing to get a law passed in Erie County that would require dentists to tell patients where their crowns, bridges, implants, and dentures are made and what's used to make them. We believe that the patients uh, have the right to understand where their uh, prosthetic is made um, and also what materials and if they're FDA approved materials. Some dental laboratories use cheaper materials from overseas not approved by the Food and Drug Administration. Materials such as lead, in many cases patients have no clue, which is concerning to Erie County Majority Leader Joe Larigo. Too often uh, de some dental labs or dentists purchase raw materials or final products f overseas and there's the potential for having hazardous materials such as lead inside uh, those products. This picture shows the difference between a non-FDA approved dental prosthetic and one that's approved. Federal requirements in this country for clothing, that have to, you have to disclose the fiber content, the manufacturer, the country of origin, and the care instructions, but no requirements on uh, products that are being placed in people's mouths. This bill now heads to the County Health Committee for discussion. Lawmakers could vote on it by this fall. In Chittawaga, Justin Moore, 7 Eyewitness News.